girl, I'm about to put my hair up because I already know that. Actually, I'm going to put my hair down because my hair it makes me look like an egg. Hi guys, my name is Naomi Terrell and welcome to my channel. So as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be doing a review slash unboxing slash first impressions on the Lux Curves waist trainer. Now a little background on me and waist training. I've been waist training on and off for a few years um i have not been consistent with it but i have owned waist trainers in the past i have the j sculpt waist trainer which is actually what i'm if you can see it what i'm wearing right now i just started becoming consistent with this one about two three weeks ago and i have noticed a difference but not big enough of a difference so the reason that i decide to order lux curves is because with the J Sculpt one, it's a Velcro. With the Lux Curves one, it's a hook and eye setup. So I feel as though that would show more progress. Like physically, I can see it better. Without further ado, I'm just gonna get right on into the review. I actually just got this today. And the thing is, I did not get it in the mail. So I have a little issue with Lux Curves right now. This is my first time purchasing from this company i have watched several youtube videos i've looked at several before and afters and that's what drew me to this brand in particular now i was like okay i'm set i'm sold uh it wasn't that expensive i believe that the price was only about 39 40 some dollars in total um with shipping and handling my total came to 48 dollars and ten cents excuse me so that's not bad at all but the thing is as i'm ordering my waist trainer you you know you have to put in your measurements and it's very important that you enter the correct measurements so that you can get the correct size for you because if you don't have the correct size it is not going to work so with that being said i already know my measurements so i know that my waist currently is at a 32 so, when I'm entering my measurements in the um website, the measurement chart, it said that if you are a 32 to 34 waist, then you are a medium. Now, girl, let me tell you this. Hold on. I have never not been a medium or in waist, like, what are they called? Waist trainers my entire life. For all the waist trainers I've had, I've never not been or I've never single once that... I've never been a medium. I've always been a large to extra large. So, to my surprise, you know, I see that and I'm saying, oh, medium, you know, maybe this little workout is working a little bit because I did go from a 35 waist to a 32 waist in a short amount of time ever since I started wearing this J Sculpt. But I just feel like it's time for something new. So, that's my first worry that i have is that i'm hoping that i will actually be able to fit into this because i don't know it just seems it just seems a little fishy to me like a medium i don't know i don't know about that i was wholeheartedly planning on getting a large but hey i'm not complaining because girl if i'm getting these losing these inches then you already know i finished my order and i'm at the part the portion of your order where you have to input your address card number all this and that so i do all my card information and then i get to my uh address information and you know how when you're doing on like iphone i don't know if it's what androids or anything else but i know for iphones um you can choose the autofill button it'll give you that option so that's what I did. So I put in my first name, Naomi. I went to type Terrell and then it said autofill. So I clicked autofill. Sorry, I feel like I have a lazy eye. It's just this eyelash was not working with me today. But anyway, I clicked autofill. And I just moved on. I pushed continue without even giving it a second thought. So the next thing, all I had to do was confirm my order. So I pushed confirm 
And then at the very end, after my thing it has confirmed, and it says, thank you, your order has been placed, da 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 then it gives you back your order statement of, you know, you're confirming your address and all that. Now, this is my mistake here. I should have looked and double checked my order thing, but I didn't think much of it because I've done this auto fill a hundred times over before, so, and it's never been wrong before. But this time in particular, see, I do not live at home. Currently, okay, well, currently I live at home, but ever since the, the middle of 2019, I have not lived at home because I moved into college. So anything that I ordered from that point on, from August 2019 up until now, anything that I have ordered, including this waist trainer, has been directed to be shipped to my college, to my university. Hmm. But because of this virus that is going around, I am home because all of the universities have been shut down. Now, me not thinking about this, I click all the fill and I just continue on with my day. So as soon as I see, thank you, your order has been confirmed, da da da, -da and I see that it says shipping address. California University of Pennsylvania I see that I said oh no I start panicking I'm like oh man I'm trying to like see if I could go back and edit it I can't edit hi guys quick side note so this is me editing right now and honestly I realized I was just talking way too much through the rest of the video up until the point that I actually showed the actual product so I just wanted to jump in really quick to give um a quick summary so basically I biffed up the order I tried to message them on Facebook and she was very uh, compliant and very willing to help me and she ended up changing the address and this all happened within three minutes after me placing the order. Everything was fine but I got a confirmation email from FedEx the next day saying that it was still being shipped to my university's address so I tried to contact the Lux Curves again through Facebook Messenger and I ne never got any replies. Uh, I tried to contact FedEx, but they said that due to shipping restrictions placed on the package that I cannot change my um, address, so I had to get Lux Curves to change it like manually. So I'm trying to contact them, and I'm still not getting any answers, and it's been like two days, still no answers. So long story short, I ended up having to drive to FedEx like 30-some minutes away to pick it up myself, and literally as soon as I got home, they messaged me back and just said, oh, here's a discount on your next order. And that was basically really it. So, all right, back to the video. So I actually just came back today um, and this is the package right here. So this switch trainer better perform miracles because right now I'm a little frustrated with you Lux Curves. But anyway, so now on to the unboxing. So. At first look, this is how I received the package. I have not done anything to it. I have not opened it. Um, everything I'm going to do right here on camera. So as you can see, it was already ripped up a bit. Um, it's kind of open right here. There's a little hole and I can feel the waist trainer right there. It's like a dog chewed it. I don't know. But I'm going to assume that's from the shipping and handling maybe. So I'm just going to open it now. I ordered the traditional long torso waist trainer, 13.5 inch, solid color, black, medium. So this is what it looks like. This is their logo right there. And this is the girl from the YouTube videos that I'll always be seeing. So we're going to open that now. Let's see. Okay, so it comes with a drawstring bag oh this is cute and then here's the actual waist trainer so it's in this paper wrap I'm gonna open that the tag and this is what the actual waist trainer looks like honey this looks petite <laughs> this does not look like it is about to fit me oh I'm scared I'm scared but it feels very durable it feels very sturdy let's see so it is made with flexi steel bone. It feels very high quality actually. So I'm glad about that. And it comes with the three row 
of with the hooks and knives and the hooks and knives actually seem really sturdy so my biggest thing I don't want the hooks or if these are the eyes I don't know I think they're the, they're the hooks yeah I don't want them to like bend so that's my biggest concern I hope that that's not what happens but as I'm pulling on it it seems like it's not doing that but this seems small I'm I hope this is now they do say that the first time that you put it on it is supposed to be really hard and they do recommend that you get somebody to help I have my mom here but I'm not gonna get her to help me because she doesn't know that I love it that she would be mad that I was spending money on this one I already just got a destroyer trainer but like it's like hey we're not gonna talk about it so I'm gonna attempt to put this on myself sorry I also forgot to mention it also comes with these cards right here um this one is just a thank you card for my purchase and this one is a care card for how you care for like the upkeeping of the waist trainer okay so i'm gonna show you my waist trainer now so this is the j sculpt that i have been wearing you know it's not bad i don't have a problem with it i just want to try the one with the hooks so but as you can see i also it doesn't really give me that hourglass look so I'm about to attempt to get this on. I'm scared. I don't think this is going to fit. Oh my goodness. Y'all, yeah, I don't I don't think this is going to fit. Wait. So they recommend to put it on higher. But okay. Oh, I got one. Okay. Okay. It's hot. <laughs> can't see over my boobs oh my goodness wait i can't <laughs> okay wait i gotta use the mirror okay so i'm already a little bit like sticky and sweaty from that way trainer so maybe that could also play a factor i don't know <sighs> y'all this is tough i don't think you understand It's supposed to be tight, but like, dang, I can't even get to the second hook. Okay, wait. Oh, okay, second hook. All right. Okay. Progress. This is like not really that flexible. Oh, no, I really need to put my hair up. Girl, it's hot. It is hot. It's hot. I got the third one. Progress. Girl. I think I'm going to have to ask my mom to come help me. Ma. Can you come help me? Barely hear her mouth. You're not naked, are you? Here, okay. We'll be back. <laughs> You're not? Come on! <laughs> you can't keep doing this for me. Doing what? These freaking waist trainers. You don't even need it. This is ridiculous. I'm on a health and fitness journey, Mom. Yeah, well, you don't need a waist trainer. I don't need it, but I want it. Hell, you got to be careful it don't smash your damn organs. It's not going to smash my organs. This don't make no sense. You can't even breathe or move. It's new. This is how waist trainers are supposed to be. It stretches over time. This don't make no freaking sense at all. Who buys stuff like this? A lot of people. It takes you 30 minutes to get in. See what I told y'all about hearing her mouth. I told y'all. Anyways, so. <laughs> tuck that little fat roll up. So this is the waist trainer. Fully on. Okay, hold on. Maybe I am a medium. <laughs> and it actually, honestly, it doesn't feel bad. Like, it's comfortable. It feels like a tight hug. Oh, y'all, I'm out of breath. Ooh. 
Oh, we definitely, definitely broke a sweat. I had to put my hair up. Hold up. Bring this back down. Got my wig moving all over the place. So that is it for the review. Um, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please give this a big thumbs up. Uh, I will be back <coughs> maybe in about a month on an update on this if you guys would like to see that. Feeling this, it feels very sturdy. It's helping with like my posture and everything. All right, Lux Curves. Y'all redeemed yourself. Y'all redeemed yourself. Okay, that's all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Please give it a big thumbs up. Hit that notification bell to be notified for every time that I post because I do plan on posting. I don't got shit better to do than this quarantine. Okay, you know, whatever. Okay.